Thank you, Fast Track Dale. We're here at the Palm Beach Kennel Club on this very special season kickoff day. It's a long time coming, folks. Some of the greatest greyhounds in the history of the Palm Beach Kennel Club today will be inducted into the Palm Beach Kennel Club Hall of Fame. So many great people up here. I'm going to introduce you in just a few minutes. But right now, I want to introduce the person that made it all happen. Our president, Pat Bernie Jr. Thank you, Bob. Appreciate it. Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the uh, inaugural, I guess, 2013 seasonal kickoff here at the Kennel Club. Part of the festivities today uh, are the, uh, this inaugural class of our Hall of Fame. Uh, Mike will talk a little bit about each one of these uh, five dogs uh, individually as we go along, and, and you'll get a sense of what their accomplishments were and why they're part of this uh, first class that we're going to uh, have a nice walkway over on to my left uh, this spring sometime. But uh, I want to welcome everybody here on behalf of my family. It's a semi-nice day, but uh, good enough uh, for what we want to do today. Um, I also wanted to thank Teresa and her crew at the publicity department for really coming together and putting this all, uh, all together on very short notice. Um, as I mentioned, we're going to do this every year, but this first class is really special. So I want to turn it back over to Mike and he can talk a little bit about each one of these talks and the owners and trainers that have come from far distances uh, to recognize their special dogs. Thanks again. Appreciate it. Thank you. We're here to celebrate some of the greatest ever animals on Today we honor the inaugural members and acknowledge their accomplishments. Greyhound's Westy Wizard is a champ. He's my man. Patsy Rendezvous and Ozzy the man. First Greyhound to ever go into the Palm Beach Kennel Club Hall of Fame is a Greyhound from the 1960s, a sensation in the 60s, made history by being the first Greyhound ever to be named to the All-American team three years in a row. Unbelievable feat. During his career from 64 to 66, he won multiple national championships and tracks throughout the country. He was also the sire of the winningest litter in the history of Greyhound racing. The first Greyhound put into the Palm Beach Kittle Club Hall of Fame will be Westy Wizard. And speaking about Westy Wizard, he is our longtime veterinarian here at the track, Dr. William Dugger. Come on up, Doc. Doc actually has a, a very interesting story. Every year around our birthday time, Doc was actually here for the first day of racing ever at Palm Beach. His mother was pregnant with him, came out to the track on the inaugural day, so Dr. Dutter is one of the only people around that can say he was here the first day when the Palm Beach Kennel Club opened. And, of course, you better ask him about Westy Wizard. What are your fond memories of this program, Doc? Actually, he was racing in the rear of the car, I think, but for a few months ago, I don't know how he was. He was right in the car. Sure, the track was buzzing back then. Of course, Westy Wizard was the greatest of all time. And now, we put Westy's Wizard's name into the Palm Beach Kennel Club Hall of Fame. Look over here, buddy. Doc, Doc. Doc. Uh, what Is a champ. And he 
here to accept the award for Visit Champ is Margaret Roban Bridges. Margaret, I'm so glad we have you out here today. What are your fond memories of the matchup between Is a Champ and Madison Joker? My fond memories is that Madison Joker was a fantastic great one too, but our, I can see Is a Champ one on the back side, he'd be about 15 in front of and then by the time he got to the bar, Joker would close him down on him, but the child would hang on What a great memory of Is a Champ, one of the greatest ever here in Long Beach Kennel Club. And now, Is a Champ states his thing, one of the greatest ever in our Long Beach Kennel Club Hall of Fame. Thanks a lot, Margaret.
That will go down in Kendall Club history. And of course, that was Ozzy the Man's retirement party. Of course, we are so glad to put Ozzy the Man's name on the Walk of Fame. He is now in the Palm Beach Kendall Club Hall of Fame. We thank Tim, Cindy, Johnny, and Tony for coming out to the track this afternoon. There you have it, folks. That is a classic 13 for the Palm Beach Kendall Club Hall of Fame. West Street Wizard is a champ. He's my man. Patsy Ryan and Ozzy the Man. Just a few months to get started. That will be right outside the first floor when you walk in. And you will see the Greyhound Hall of Fame. The star of the show. Five fantastic Greyhounds. I'd like to thank everybody for coming out today for this ceremony. And thank everybody who came from far away to join us for the Palm Beach Kennel Club Greyhound Hall of Fame.